Hi, my name's Max, and welcome to Trailblazer Reloaded. On this season of Leagues, we get to pick three areas to explore and try out the new relics. I don't have much of a plan, but it's going to be fun either way. Let's get started. Alright, I think that should be the task done there. Uh, this will be some nice prey XP. They nerfed Soul Wars, which is really upsetting, uh, because I couldn't quite... Uh, and in my points the night that it was um, that it was available, I like went to bed right before I handed them in. Probably should have realized they would nerf it, but let's go buy some Mystic now. Uh, I believe we have the level to get in the Mage's Guild. I think it's like 66 or maybe 63, so we just barely made it, and I have a ton of cash. Alright, we have all... I, I think you can turn off the buy noted thing. Oh, that's it right there. This is unnoted at the bank, no big deal. There's full Mystic, and I got a challenge for going into the Mage's Guild. So let's see where we're at. Um, basically, I've been working on editing, just doing some fishing and cooking this morning uh, while I'm working, and we are 29 tasks. I'm probably going to maybe do another Slayer task while I'm AFK, and then I'll start chipping away at these 29 tasks, just kind of going through the areas and doing easy ones. RP Bug Swarms. I feel like that's bad. I think I took a lantern before I'm pretty sure I bought a lantern all right I did get one but I need 33 fire making to be able to light it so I'm gonna have to train a little bit of fire making here shouldn't take too long just 33 oh I just lit all of those at once uh, I didn't know that was a thing I'm already level 16 with one little inventory there that must be one of the passive relic relic effects because when I did fire making earlier I did not have that let's see if we can do it with like how many it will do. It looks like maybe 3x3 three three is it, but it could be more. Yeah, 3x3. Three three. That's crazy. And I got an achievement for burning smoke logs. 750 total. I'm almost high enough level. Let's chop a few more here. I have Willow, but I can't quite do those yet. I have to do a few normal logs too, I think. Alright, there's 30. Let's see how much Willow gets. And I accidentally equipped it even before it was lit, and I got 40 points just for that. So, might as well just send all these real quick, get our level up a bit. See how much. Oh, 6k per. That got me to 33, so I can light this now. Uh, I might as well do the rest of these. This is so crazy. This guy just rolled up in the same gear as me, doing mage, and his name is Debuff, and I'm Debo. That's so crazy. Okay, he's tripping out as much as I am. That's so funny. Alright, my AFK time is just about up. I just finished editing my first video, which I, hopefully you guys will see. Make sure you go check that out and subscribe if you have not already. But here we are at 60 defense. That was my goal for uh, this little AFK session. How many points is this going to be? Wow, 80 for the hobby shield. That's really good. Completed. Alright, that is 10 tickets, which should be enough to buy a Snapdragon. Nice. 40 point task. Grab a pineapple, I believe that's a task, yeah. And then I'm gonna pop in this dungeon here. Hoping I can fish these without having done Taibo Wanai Trio. I know I need it for the crown ones, but maybe not for these. Yeah, I was able to catch them. Alright, um, I need a good food source, and I can just spam these, so I'm going to buy a ton of them. I wish there was more than three, but it doesn't really matter. I can buy a lot quick. Alright, a thousand should last me a while until I find some better food sources, at least. I guess they'll always be kind of useful. Alright, there's a greater demon down. I think that was a task. Yeah, it was. How many points? Oh, it's a combat task, too, so I don't see yet. Uh, only 10 points. Alright, I think that's most of the stuff in Karamja that I want to do. Let's look in some of the other areas. I knocked out a couple easy tasks in Varrock, and now I'm gonna go do a Brave Fighter real quick. I have one key, so I hope this goes well. I know I need an axe, and I think that's it. Um, shouldn't be too hard. Ready to play boss, right? Okay, good, I can hit him with mage. Should've brought an anti-poison, but that's alright. Maybe I'll even get him before he spawns his little little guys. No, they spawned. Easy Briophyta's Essence. No. But I'll take a beginning.
beginner clue. What was that? Oh, I got three of the combat tasks anyway. That's cool. It is Demon Slayer done. All right, let's get a task from him. That should be another Harpy Bug Swarm task. I guess it's easy. I gotta remember to talk to him and ask for higher level tasks. Stop checking my combat level. Nice. That should make me get better tasks. Technically, they're a Slayer monster. I wonder if they have a superior. I don't think so, because I'm sure I've looked at the list a million times, but curious. Oh, I just casted a wave spell. I was going to kill a steel dragon for the last task, but that should get me there. I can uh, unlock my next area. I, maybe I need a bank for it. We'll see. Desert is definitely my next one. It's going to give me barrage and a bunch of other good things, too. There's a lot of points there. Nice, it auto-completed a bunch of quests, and I think I get points for a lot of those. Alright, this guy should be dead, and I'm gonna get a Visage super quick. No Visage. Never lucky. Alright, we got a bunch of uh, tasks we can do here. Pyramid Plunder would probably be easy if I can go down and do that. Hopefully I can. I wonder if there's a teleport on this that would get me anywhere near there. Let's see, maybe Palvanich? I'm going to grab my Ancient Staff, and then I think I'm going to go switch to Ancients. I don't see a reason why I wouldn't. Uh, I know I need to... Yes, please. Nice, I got it. I know I need to um, unlock Ali Morrison's shop so I can start buying Blood Runes. Can I use it yet? Oh, I need 50 attack. Damn it. I'm going to have to go get that as well. Oh, I didn't do Waterfall Quest, and now I can't go do it. <laughs> And so I missed out on the XP. I'm gonna have to get 10 levels just, uh, you know, without anything. Just floor one down. I wonder if it's worth it. I bet Scepter's increased drop, but I don't, it's not really worth it. I guess it'd be cool to get. It's like I got enough points for the Relic, and I get a ton of XP for strength every time I open one of these, because I don't have any uh, levels. Alright, here's the last floor. That's a lot of points for all that. I overshot it quite a bit. Here, let me open this while I have seven seconds if it actually works. I doubt it'll go through. Now I'm getting kicked out. Not bad. I kind of want to go back through there and do a little bit of strength training just on that. Alright, I guess I wasn't recording there, but um, I'm going to go grab a staff here. Oh, I don't know if I recorded picking my relic. I meant to record it. Let's sh let me show you just in case. Uh, I picked Bloodthirsty because I would rather have a combat one. I'd get sick of Treasure Hunter. Uh, I don't care that much about skilling. This one's going to let me get an Imbued Heart a lot easier, which is going to be really important for my build. Unfortunately, they patched the Soul Wars bug where it was giving a bunch of XP before my buddy was getting 2 mil drops, which stinks because some people got to take advantage of it and other people didn't. Um, and I had those points, if you saw in the last video, I had the points sitting there, I just didn't have the prayer level to put them in it yet. And the next morning it was patched, so I kind of got unlucky on that, but I think you can still get like 160k XP a day in prayer, so I'm going to take advantage of that. The Soul Wars world was full, so I went to the one that was right next to it, because it had a big population too. And I found there's another, you know, there's a, I found there's a whole group of people doing it here as well. And in this world, everyone's just rushing the avatars, so the games end much quicker. It's actually really nice, and I have happened to win the last two. Ooh, I got a lot more zeal on that one. I think it was because I did more avatar damage. Um, that should be enough to get my XP cap for today. Let's throw... I'm gonna... I guess we'll do 100 at a time. How much is that gonna be? 50k? Uh, that's okay. What is that? Reach 75 combat? Okay. Do another 100. Now I'm getting 70k per drop. I was made aware that I could go to Tears of Guthix and do that. I think my lowest level is farming, so that should be some easy XP there. Alright, I managed to get 86 tiers. That's decent for the amount of quest points I have, I think. Let's see. Ooh, I got a task for it too. And Almost 12k farming XP. This is a big jump. I'm getting close to a thousand total now. I'm not doing ogres. I guess I have low slayer levels, so what are they going to give me? A jad? Yeah, I'm definitely going to take this task. Switch task to jad. Alright. 
I'm gonna have to go get um, prayer pots from the Monkey Madness 2 tunnels, I think, and then I should be okay to do this. Nice, quick little sand crab session. Uh, I came back from taking a shower and I was the attack level that I needed. Um, I can use Ancient Staff now. Getting pretty good XP here. I'll track the rates in a minute, but uh, the main reason I'm here is Prayer Pots, and that is also going well. I don't know how many I'm going to want for Fire Cape, but I should be able to get a ton here, and I don't know if I'll get Barrage first, but definitely going to get some XP before I go in there. Alright, I'm getting like 1.5 mil defense XP almost, and almost 3 mil mage XP. Um, definitely not in the best spot here, but uh, that one was taken, so I am just I took what I could get. Better than hopping and trying to find something. Alright, I'm just making up some bronze dart tips. You can buy infinite bars from the shop in the Alcarid Pass there. And I'm sure they're going to be decent fletching XP, even though they're bronze with the multiplier and everything. I'm just going to make some of those really quick. I wanted to get a little bit of smithing up. Uh, I think I might try to go over to the Varric Museum and see if they have any lamps for me to try to get some herb lore up. Let's see how much XP this is. Alright, I got one lamp, a moment of truth. I can't use it on herb lore. I need 20. I was worried that was going to happen. Uh, I have some guams in the bank. A few other herbs. I'll figure something out. Let me see where they sell Eyes of Newt. The only place I can think of that I might have access to is Gusanoth. I know there's an Herblore shop in there. Um, I think it's right in the middle, so let's go see if I can buy from uh, the ogre guy there. It's looking promising. There's an herb shop. Trade this guy. Uh, it's probably going to be him. Please let me do it. Yes! Alright, we can buy a billion of these. All right, let's see this XP roll in. Tack pots, 300 XP per. Nice, and it's a little achievement there. Will this get me to 20? If not, there's unicorns right over there I can go kill. Nice, perfect, 20, and then I can use this on that to get me another 12K XP. It takes me all the way up to 32. Time to chill and do some fishing. I think 50 salmon is an achievement, and maybe some other ones, we'll see. Alright, that's 50 salmon done. I'm still really regretting not doing those quests for uh, the XP and now I can't do them. Uh, which I should have realized, stupid mistake, but I'm going to see if I can maybe do some barb fishing instead. Uh, get my strength up a little bit. Alright, this should get me to 45 strength with one more fish. I hit 70 fishing as well. 70 fishing, 45 strength, 45 agility lets me catch the highest level fish. Ooh, I just caught one already. Um, it's not a task for that, but it's going to be much better XP here, so I'll probably stay a little bit longer. Um, I'm still AFKing, so maybe I'll get up to 76. I think that's what you need to get in the fishing guild, I and to fish sharks, which I'm sure are tasks in themselves. Alright, nice easy teleport here. It's 40 points there. Are there any shops here I could check out? I'm looking for one with like a good stock of sharks, if that's possible. No, they don't have any. Nothing's in stock. It seems like none of the fishing stores have any fish in stock. Um, I'm gonna, I guess I'll catch a shark just in case. There's a monkfish caught. I was hoping to get a little bit more from fishing, but that's okay. Next I'm gonna go probably grab a rune axe from uh, the tree spirits. I'm usually pretty good at these things, but I messed up somewhere uh, on like two of them, so I just looked and found a plug-in for it, which is nice. Let's see what these runes are. 37 bloods? Okay, let's just... Uh-oh. Okay, thank god. Iron men cannot buy items overstocked. Something weird is happening here. Um, let's see if I can buy any of the other ones. No. None of them. That's not good. Somehow they're overstocked. Alright, this is looking more promising. Nice, okay, I can buy a ton. Let me buy a ton in case that people start trolling and overstocking somehow. Maybe somehow I did it, I don't know. And chop this and fight these guys. Cast an Ice Blitz. I wonder if casting a Blood Blitz gives me anything. No, just ice. Nice, so I shouldn't even really have to... Oh god, I'm attacking multiple things at once. Um, but I shouldn't really have to even safe spot them. 
Finally, I went like two and a half times the rate. I saw pretty much everyone come and go uh, before I got it, but that should be kind of best in slot unless I get very lucky at Winter Tot. Um, I'm gonna take this straight to Draenor and chop some uh, Willow Logs and burn some, because I think there's a task for chopping 100 and burning 100, and I think I'm about halfway on both. There's also one for chopping with a Rune Axe. I should go try that Addy Axe just in case, but I doubt there is one. I'm gonna go grab it, just try it out. There was one for equipping an adamant weapon, that's kind of cool. Nice, I just popped over to iron rank with those 100. Nice, there's level 50 and 100 willow logs burned. I think that should be enough to let me get into winter tot when I get there. Corrin's my next area, if uh, I hadn't mentioned it before. Alright, a little AFKing and I've uh, accounted for that blunder of not doing waterfall quest. Um, Kind of a cesspool here, everyone's fighting for crabs and trying to steal each other's spots, so I'm gonna get out of here. Alright, here's the setup I'm going to be going with. I'm going to start out just uh, kind of AFKing with Prey Melee on. And I'm not going to do this this cave fast. I'm not going to go for the speed things. I might do that later on when I have a little better stats and gear. Uh, but I should get some uh, points just for doing one cave and some combat achievements. And there's a lot I can do afterwards, which is going to be nice. So for the first like 10 minutes or so, I'm just going to AFK with Prey Melee on. Right, I was able to AFK my way up to the mage phase, and now I'm going to try to plow through the rest of this. I was a little worried about uh, the damage I'd be doing on the mages, but it seems to be working just fine. Alright, here we go. It's been a little while since I've done a jad, but I don't think it should be too hard. As long as I can hit. Yep, I'm hitting. I don't have the balls to tank a hit. My health is not high enough. Such a good chance he would one-shot me. Alright, there it is. That's a massive XP drop. 300k Slayer XP. It took me all the way to the 67. I uh, I think I was 51 before. Pick up this toe cool. Nice. No pet. Um, I got a bunch more toe cool. Uh, I should be able to pass this vent now. Let me... I think it should show him there. Nice. Let me through. Mole old wreck. Uh, let's see what I can do here. Okay, one thing I know is I just had to equip it to get those points, so that's 200 points right there. I don't think I need it for anything else, so we're going to sacrifice it over here. I'm going to need to get one back eventually, but, well, probably, unless I go straight for Inferno. Inferno. Yes. Okay, that's another 200 points. Alright, how much are these? 100k each. I should be able to buy one of everything. Let's equip all this stuff. This is actually my best in slot uh, melee gear now. I get 80 points for that. I think I get some points for that. Let's see. Uh, it's not popping up. Oh, there it is. 80 and then maybe 80 for that one too. So that's some really good points there. Was that 240? Uh, so now all I have left is pickpocketing. Maybe I like fishing an eel or something. I don't think so though. I looked at all the fishing challenges and... Uh, doing these challenges over here. So let's get back to pickpocketing. Well, that was a pain in the ass, but I got it. I think it was 200 points, too. Yeah, elite? I think that's 200. That's brutal if you don't have ice gloves, just a heads up. Alright, the other thing I'm gonna do while I'm here is there's a crazy stock of these. Uh, I need to go get uh, more toe cool, and then I'm gonna buy a ton of diamonds to cut. But I managed to buy a thousand uh, diamonds. I thought I would get a little bit more, but I'm sure this will... Yeah, I'm gonna be flying up XP. Not too bad, I made it to 75 crafting with those. Uh, I'll probably do another session, and then uh, I can do some light orbs. I think if I do 200, that is a decent challenge. And then I'll be able to craft a fury, and maybe even the bracelet. I don't remember what level the bracelet is. Uh, but we're a ways out from... Not armor, jewelry. We're a ways out from uh, being able to get a Zenite anyway. I've not done these in a long time, and I think until I do the Inferno I can only go up to three. I'm gonna try to knock them out, but <laughs> I'm definitely gonna be rusty, so we'll we'll see how I do. This is actually kind of hard just because uh, the healers were hitting me so hard. Um, hmm. I wonder if I'm gonna be able to do that in the next one. I could always cast like a Ice Burst on the healers and run away from them. Alright, two wasn't that bad. It took me a few tries just because uh, I I uh, the, was getting destroyed by the healers. How many points is that? Did it pop up? There it is, 80. 
Uh, does it let me do three? It does let me do three. Yeah, I'm gonna wait on that one until I get Blood Barrage at least. Alright, let's grab another assignment here. 50 Mithril Dragons? Started killing the dragons. Uh, I had to do Barbarian in training, but I remembered I could unlock... Oh, that's kind of expensive. Is it worth it? How hard is it to get Mithril Bars and to do smithing? I'm gonna do Giant's Foundry, but I will need bars, so I'll just unlock it. Why not? So nice being able to just Blood Barrage back up. I can tank a lot of things doing this. Most Slayer, I'll just be able to kind of base tank with this. Especially once I get Barrage. Uh, so I finished that task and I got two Chewed Bones, so let's see if we can construct these real quick. And Blood Runes from that one. Never lucky. Black Demons. Hmm. Should I go for Demonic Gorillas? I don't think I'm there yet, stats-wise. Maybe I'll give a few a shot. Okay, while I'm having fun, this is definitely not worth, uh... This is not worth doing with, uh, my current stats and gear. Ew, I got something for killing a demonic. Alright, I got two kills done. Uh, it was fun. Definitely not worth it until I get a little bit better stats. Maybe I'll do some AFKing, uh strength over the next, you know, few uh, days and we can go back there. Alright, let's give KQ a, a try. I've heard you can just mage the whole thing. Dog, I am getting my cheeks clapped. There's no streaming to be happening right now. Working log, it's working. Nice, melted him. Oh, my first Ceridoman brew. There's 94 magic. I can now cast Ice Barrage. Uh, I'm definitely going to do it for the points at least, but I'm kind of enjoying doing Blood Barrage. I don't know if it's worse DPS. I'll do Ice Barrage for a little while. But getting the health back constantly is really nice for a lot of tasks. All right, let's send this Obor kill. I think if I freeze it and don't let him touch me, I think I might have messed something up already. Let's see. Yeah, I got a bunch of stuff there, and it looks like... Oh, I got a test for 10 combat achievements, too. Another one down. Oh, I got another key for it. And I got another task. Imagine if I got the Giant's Club, that'd be kind of cool. I don't think it would be any useful. Maybe it would be good on the melee build, because it would speed it up. Alright, he's down again. No loot for that one. I wanted to quickly get my mining up to 40 so I can mine Gemrock. If I'm doing all the Slayer, I definitely want to have those two bracelets. And with my perk, if you remember, no longer consumes charges and have a 35% chance to trigger. I want to make both of those, and I'm going to need to mine some Gemrocks to do that. So I got some silver bars and got up to 40 mining so I can uh, go grab a red topaz. It's going to be a little hard because I don't have a glory, but... I should be able to get one pretty quick. I don't know if any of you watch that gate jambling stuff on uh, TikTok, if that ever comes up for you. But uh, this is significantly less fun than that. Yes, I finally got the jade. Or, not the jade, the red topaz. I'm just praying I don't crush it. I'm going to try to mine one more real quick. Alright, please don't screw me here. Oh, thank god. That was the only one I need. Alright, let's enchant these really quick. I think this might be a sapphire enchant. Nice. So I have those permanently unlocked now. Oh my god, I got my first superior finally, and I think it's one of the special ones. It's just a pyre fiend, so I doubt it's gonna do drop much. But this is really cool. Defeat a superior slayer creature. What did I get? Scroll box medium. And snape grass. It does supply drops. That's really cool. And I get some Slayer points for it as well. That was awesome. I want to get more of those. Yeah, I don't see anything that would be preventing me from getting good tasks, so... Yes! I All that complaining and I get Dust Devils right away. Um, I think I'm going to go to Palvanich to do these. Yeah, right? That's Because I, I don't have Corrin just yet. Hopefully I'll get it soon my first dust devil um it'd be nice to get that room but it seems like there's someone in every world so i'm just gonna settle with this one here's my first superior uh that was pretty quick 
It's not too bad doing it in this room here. Come on, give me something good. Uh, nine Ranar seeds, that's good. My first battle staff. I thought it was one of the good ones, but I know there's a task for that. Hith bars. That's all the good stuff there. It looks like the normal superiors just don't have the thing over their head. Come on, give me something. Got Slayer points still. Doesn't look like any. Oh, another one back to back. This is one of the good ones. It's so weird not picking any of this loot up, but none of it's really useful to me. Picking up a few herbs and things. Alright. Or Ranar seeds, I'll take those. Won't really matter once I get the TOA, but until then, they'll be really nice. There's another superior. Did I even get a supply drop that time? I don't think so. I guess it doesn't do one every time. That was one of the better ones, too. Oh, I just got two tasks super quick, and one was a heart task. I guess I hadn't equipped a dragon weapon or spec yet. Alright, I think this is my, like, 8th to 10th one this task so far. I want to get at least one of the... I just want to hit the table, even if it's not the heart. Did I get quorum seeds as my supply? Alright, I'm looking at tasks to bump myself up to the next relic. Uh, I just talked to the wise old man, he had me get some goblin bones. Now let's go to Padua. If you cast that, it's supposed to be... Oh, there's two of them. I figured I would need higher construction, but I don't. That was 40 points right there, and now I can teleport to Alvanich, which is a lot faster than the way I was going. Alright, this was an easy one. Uh, 50 men of fight pickpockets. Uh, it didn't happen. <laughs> I missed something. Maybe I have to knock him out? I'm gonna look it up and try to figure it out. I, that's so weird that it's not working. Apparently I have to knock him out first. Um, I don't know if there's a place to... I think I have to go to Ali Morrison and buy a blackjack or get a blackjack. I made a mistake trying to do this with such bad stats and gear. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna be here a while. At least I'm not taking a lot of damage. Did not have a whole lot to use against the crush guy, so I grabbed a rune spear that I picked up. Uh, we'll see if I can even kill him. Oh, my stats are getting low too. Nice, I just read that if you leave through the door, you lose your progress. If you just die or teleport out, you don't. So I blew it. I just walked right out the door. I'm gonna have to get some kind of restore potion or something. I think that's some really good progress for today. Uh, I think this is day three or four. I'm, I'm all turned around. It's been a, just a wormhole. But I did some AFKing on Sand Crabs while I did some editing there. Got up to 77 strength, 70 attack. We're ending with uh, 2850 league points. I'm going to pick my next relic now to finish the video. I'm going with Runus Powers. Uh, some people might think it's silly, but I think it's really going to be great for magic and just for a general offensive... Uh, damage there when I do raids and things. I'm going for really a powerhouse build for uh, PBM. The skills will come, um, so I'm not going to pick a skilling relic. We're going to have to be in a bank for that one. Uh, Runa's powers, let's pick it. I'm going to get four times drop chance at things, which is going to be very good for hopefully getting this imbued heart knocked out. You're done with Runa's powers. I can switch that on and off. Um, let's turn it on really quick. Yeah, I don't have that many unlocked, so I'm going to have to do a lot more prayer, but once I get all the way up to 92, it's going to be really, really great uh, with Intensify. What is the mage? Okay, we want to get to 86 as soon as possible, too, so I'll be working on that as well. But I think that's where I'm going to call it for today. I already have a little bit of a head start on the next relic, which is going to be very good for some damage, and I will be working on that in the next video. The desert was really great to boost my points up and get some things done. 
But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to leave a like if you did and subscribe if you're not because I'm going to be grinding even more this season and I want you guys to come with me. Leave a comment if you have any ideas for things I missed or things I should do in the future. But with that being said, I will see you in a couple days with a new video.